customizing the default 2011 WordPress theme. How to widen the sidebar so that a, well, let's say a 250 pixel wide item will fit. An item like an affiliate banner, for example, or a video, or one of my favorite plugins that I'm not able to use with the default settings is WP125, which is an advertising plugin that allows you to put in two rows of 125 pixel wide thumbnail images to advertise for affiliate products or other items. Well, at the current width of about 180 to 190 pixels wide, that does not work. It only puts in one column. Yeah, I know, I'm a little nitpicking, but if you can widen this sidebar a little bit to, let's say, 280 pixels, then that WP125 plugin will work perfectly. It will allow you to put in multiple rows of 125 pixel wide thumbnail images as well as larger videos in your sidebar and of course those affiliate banners too. Now one of the cool things about the 2011 theme versus prior default themes is that with the 2011 theme in the default settings even this narrow 180 to 190 pixel wide sidebar it will still take the larger images 250 300 pixel wide images without cutting off that amount of the image that doesn't fit into the container, it will actually take it upon itself to squeeze the width of that image down to fit into this container. It might suffer quite a bit in the quality of the image, but you will see the entire image. But we don't want that. Not whenever we can apply a simple bit of code to our style.css and get this. So let's go ahead and take a look at that code now, and I'll show you what we're talking about. It's very simple. Now frankly, with this particular code, I wouldn't mess with anything. You can, by all means, mess with as much of it as you want. The width here, I wouldn't go much more than 30%. If you wanted to, I found that 32%, it screws things up. What happens is the widget area gets too wide for the content area, and it shoots all the way down to the bottom below the content area above the footer. So if you get too greedy and you increase the width too much, and your sidebar disappears, just scroll down to the bottom of your page and you'll see it laying right there. So I found that 30% is about max. Let's go ahead and copy this into our clipboard. Add this to our style.css. And I'm using a child theme. Let's go ahead and save this and, and upload this into our child theme and overwrite our existing style.css. Now if you're not using a child theme, then just put this code at the very bottom of your parent themes style.css and all should be right with the world. Now let's head on back over to our browser and refresh and there you go. Now like I was saying if you get too greedy, too wide of a number here say 33, 35 percent, even 32 percent I believe is too much then you'll find your sidebar right down here above your footer but below the content area. 